Hey kids, good morning. Here we are again. Well, they said make another, and I guess that's what we're gonna do. Uh, today, we're just going to hit uh, some closer to home superchargers and um, leave here from Savage. Then we're gonna go down to a brand new one in Owatonna and see what else I can find to do in Owatonna. After that, we'll be, uh, that one just opened a couple weeks ago. And after that will be St. Peter, which has actually been around since like 2021. I just haven't been out um, that way and needed a charge because it's not really that far from me. So got my way too festive Starbucks mug and there is what we're doing. We're just gonna run this triangle and see what there is to do along the way. We've settled onto the interstate so I can talk a little more about what's going down today. Um, basically, I woke up this morning and I saw it was going to hit 50-something degrees, and that's good enough for our kind of last call before the snow flies, so I thought I'd get to put some miles on and see about picking up some superchargers, which I just used for inspiration of uh, somewhere to go, and then check out the rest of the place in the town or the region. I haven't thought much beyond that. Uh, but I have been thinking about this coffee. Let's talk about my coffee. I thought I would uh, try something they put on the menu that just has oat milk by default. It's one of the holiday drinks and it's some kind of gingerbread something or other. So I got that and I put the sugar at half volume. And it's still completely ridiculous. Um, but there is caffeine in it. And even though it's way too sweet, I'm going to drink it. That's what I signed up for. Well, it's going to be pretty quick, just about 40 minutes down to Owatonna. And a couple of things I can share with you that I know about the place. One, there's an awesome municipal water park that is kind of just the right size for just the right amount of money. Um, and it's great if you want to have something to do with your family down there. Also, if you want Tex-Mex, you should go to Grace's Tex-Mex. Alas, the agenda is filling in. I found a couple things to check out. We're going to check out uh, Mineral Springs Park. And maybe there will be a walk or a hike there that will be cool. Also, the Village of Yesteryear, which is not doing tours this late in the season, but I'm going to scout it out and see if it would be worth visiting again if I'm back down here for the water park or whatever. Welcome to Owatonna. That was a quick trip down, uh, just about 50 miles, and I need zero charge estimated here, but I'm still gonna plug in because it's a new one. And kind of interesting, this one is at a Culver's, and it's on a wacky curve, let me show you. So, it actually comes around. curve of the parking lot and very interestingly it is near Walmart as well so that almost feels like it would be an Electrify America. I don't think I've ever seen a supercharger this close to Walmart. So, anyhow here we are we'll get plugged in. Well that's certainly gonna be all the charge we need here so I think that we will just get moving on gonna check out some of the hiking trails here.
Hasta luego. gonna stroll through here they're not doing tours today let's see what we see Pretty cool. It'd be nice to come back and get a guided tour of that. I think from here it's going to be directly to our next supercharger. We'll go over to St. Peter and find something interesting there to do while I'm on the way. to the Gustavus Arboretum and it is 65 degrees. Take a quick stroll. <laughs>
Gotcha. Oh, there's some kind of garden over here. Take a look at that. Well, this was a bonus. I'm getting hungry, so I'm gonna head to the tavern on third, get a bite to eat. Well, I stumbled on the Vikings game, so I don't know if you can hear me, but here we have burnt ends and a beef and cheddar, except it's prime rib. And a fat wash drink. They use their brisket fat to fat wash that one. All done at Third Street Tavern. I was very impressed with their food, so it would uh, be a thumbs up from me. The burnt ends were fantastic. The fries were also fantastic. And they had a prime rib beef and cheddar thing that was really great. Um, I'd put them right up against something like OMC all day. Maybe, maybe they're even better. I'll have to try again and find out. All right, on to the supercharger, which is four minutes away. So we're gonna barely get a precondition in, but I'm already over 95 degrees. Um, so I think we'll be okay. We'll see when we get there. Welcome to St. Peter. The battery heaters are screaming and it's already over 102 degrees, so it's gonna do just fine. And it looks like I only need about five minutes here. Uh, this one's out of Hy-Vee, as you can see right over there, which is not uncommon. A lot of them in Minnesota are at Hy-Vees. at St. Peter and if anything I'm overcharged a little bit totally good to roll home so off we go I just went past Minnesota's largest candy store or what I also call the big yellow tent but what's actually called I think Jim's Apple Farm and did not stop which I'm relatively proud of. And took a look at some of the more supercharger stats while I was charging. What I have left is basically two of the oldest superchargers in Minnesota, the first two. One that's down southwest in Worthington and the Duluth supercharger, which is a weird one inside a parking garage. Um, and it's just been obviated by a lot of other superchargers around there. So, but I'm in Duluth a lot, so I'll get that one pretty easily. And then uh, after that, it's the ones that I haven't gotten to are all built in June of this year or after. So there was really kind of an explosion this year, but it'll be fun to go get those as well.
back home literally at sunset as you can probably see and around these parts yeah that's like 4 30 in the afternoon this time of year that's exciting okay so trip stats we did 168 miles 61 kilowatt hours 361 watt hours per mile a little high not unexpected uh, with all the preconditioning and speed we were going and i think that's all the stats you're going to get this time so we've reached the end of this smash and grab Owatonna St. Peter Supercharger Spectacular.